Welcome back everyone, Kremlin Archer here, time for some more Breath Edge. Um, I'm out in the field, I was trying to get together the resources for the the next suit, which I'm not sure if I can actually see the this engineering suit. Yeah, you can't see what it is, what the materials are. But um, needless to say, it includes lead paint and fabric, which is what I'm out here in the field trying to find. I was trying to, I thought I could get back to that bit of paint that we saw before, but I clearly don't remember exactly where it was. So, uh, yeah, so it's being a little bit more difficult than I thought. Let's go over there. And I was running across things, new things to see. So I was like, I should probably bring the, the rest of the crew in on this. I could remember where those paint things are. Let's go check out this. This has a question mark on it. What are you? Docking gates. These are obsolete, although they come in quite handy in case of emergency evacuation. What is that? Fine metal? What am I scanning? Really wants me to scan something here, but I'm not really sure what. This? No? Ah, there we go. You don't have any cloth for me, huh? Kind of a bummer. Alright, where is my machine? There it is. Hey. So we're heading towards... I'm trying not to get shot on our way to do this recharge over here. I wish I could remember where that paint is. Also there's something I'm supposed to do over there. Cause like all this, this like really hot section down here we can't explore. The cold section we can't really do until we get this suit made. So I'm trying to do. Let's also drink. Yeah. Alright, what's going on out here? If the gun doesn't work, it doesn't mean you can poke your head right into its barrel. Although such a classified device causes an uncontrolled execution of my curiosity program. Ooh, what are those lights in the distance? <laughs> Apparently, these are the discharge cells. It's unlikely that you'll be able to fix them, but I'm sure that there are some spare ones somewhere. Although, I recommend that you think about why you would want to repair this gun in the first place. Discharge cell. Oh, I know where those... Those are the things... Those are the things you took out of the other gun. Okay, I know now. I see now. Good to know, okay. Now, back to the paint hunt. Uh, as soon as we refill our oxygen again. Something to scan over there. Something unknown 900 meters away. I guess we'll go towards those. Have I been to this coffee? That's another question. We'll take care of this first.
I remember. I remember seeing this, and not actually really caring about it, but getting it. We're gonna get it anyways. I think I was low on durability before, which is why I didn't pick it up. Oops. All right, coffee. I hope you come with oxygen. And also, fabric would be nice. Oh, we've been here already. It's unclear if it was placed in the teapot on purpose or it got stuck there itself due to progressive obesity. A rare device to approximately tell the time. My internal clock crashed during the incident, but even being broken, it shows the time much more accurately once per day. After the 12th Space Congress, at which the mug was proclaimed a vessel for the proletariat, cups were banned and their production stopped. You can get a fine or sentence to manual labor for this rare object. There's some fabric. Uh, shears. This. Alright, so I now have three fabric, which gets me the... F I have one back at... No, I don't have one back at base. I don't think I do. Well, we shouldn't plan on it if that's the... Anyways. Oh, that's some rubber over here. Um, I'm gonna want at least one more fabric before I feel comfortable. Vinegar, a tea bag, and two pieces of sugar. No such tea recipe was found in the database. Alright, we have to use it. Yeah, yeah, I know. Well, we might be able to make that, actually. It's only 300 meters away. We got a full blast. I bet I can get oxygen, or not oxygen, um, fabric in here somewhere. I mean, also oxygen. I don't know why it didn't just come inside instead of filling up that way. Is a more direct route? Inventory is full. Made some space. All right, so I have the fabric I need. Now we just we just need to find wherever that paint was, and I can't remember where it was now. Also, I'm going to try and figure out what this question mark is over here because it's clearly not. I thought it was the turret. Stay away from me. But it's clearly not the turret. Turned this thing off, didn't I? Oh, it's this. Some kind of military spacesuit prototype with a jet booster. Hey. I wonder if it's possible to replicate this system without the risk of catching fire like he did. Obsolete accelerator. I don't really need that though. I've got. I already have a better one. Thanks though. Alright, let's get reoxygenated here. First aid kit with me. I thought I might, but I don't. Yes, yes, guns nearby, I know. Alright, now the question becomes we've seen it before, but where was the ox? Where was the paint? Because that's what I need. I need paint. We hit this engineering thing up. We've definitely flown past this before. But I'm not sure we've actually. 
on this one. There's an engineering shuttle ahead. I wonder how you find everything so quickly. Is it because of my hints? They definitely help. I don't think we've been to this one yet. Hopefully it has oxygen in it. That's a familiar way of repairing things. Did you study the same manual as well? Pink underpants. Pink underpants with a bunny tail. Not the most common outfit, especially for men, so I wouldn't wear these. I hope this underwear doesn't belong to him, although I still wouldn't touch it. I already know this. I know I've already learned it. I just wanted to take it. Yeah, so so this thing. So here's the engineering spacesuit. So I've got the resin. I've obviously got the aluminum on me. I just need a roll of fabric times two. Oh, we need more fabric than that. Okay, well, let's do part of that. I thought it was one. But we're in a good place then. I'm glad I poked my head in here. This should be the fabric we need. Cool. This is probably also one of the scans. Likely that it will fly with a broken engine, but the design of the steering wheel is quite interesting. Puts us three out of four on the steering wheels. Postcard with a photo of the first space car launched into space. Photo was taken not so long ago by a famous traveler, IMAX. Up to this moment, it was believed that this car was drawn by gravity of the sun planet and destroyed. Alright, so can't do anything with that. Alright. Back to looking for, uh, paint. There it is. Fuel is okay. That kind of looks like paint over there. Hey, we found the paint. You need the drill for this, is that right? Yeah, drill. Oh, my inventory's full. Um, drink some more. I just need the one. Although I'm worried we're gonna need more in the future. Uh, drop. Drop this honey. Not the nutritious goo. Okay. Happy with that. So we'd have dropped it way over here. That is not my ride out of here. Where is my ride? There it is. Alright, let's get home and make a suit. Actually, where's the closest oxygen? Uh, nowhere close. Okay, well, we'll just use a candle then. Alright, I think I should have everything now. I 
I need my two resin, which is just in this box. All right, make me an engineer suit. So this should protect us from strong, strong temperature changes, it says. Engineering service on large spaceships was always engaged in a variety of work. The repair of res and we lost it. The repair of the reserve combustion engine work during its work to the emergency elimination of a hole in the spaceship in the outer space. This is why I try to protect engineering suits from everything, especially from strong temperature changes. Heat and cold are felt unpleasant in the suit, but not fatal. Cool. Put this in here. So I think, if I understand that correctly, that should mean that we can go into the cold area and not get cold now. Which I think I'm going to do real quick, just to see, because I want to see how that engine thing is supposed to work. But we can never get the time to look at it, because we always get too cold too fast. We're going to go check it out. I hope I've understood this correctly, at least. Yeah, it says freezing danger. We're not growing any ice. So now that we over here, we actually have time to look at this without freezing to death. Fuel tank is empty. This is the question that I have. Where is the fuel tank? Aha! Beef pellets! Okay. Well, let's go up and see if we can... We have beef pellets back home. Let's go see if we can just get some here, though. It would be nice to finally get something accomplished. <laughs> Ten of them. Recharged. Go. It's possible there won't be ten beef pellets up here at this point because we stole a bunch of them already. But hopefully there are. Titanium. It's one. Oh, that is synthetic manure. That's not a beef pellet. Oh. 
turret somewhere near. I know, game. Still synthetic manure. There's one. Oh, that's actual meat. Need beef pellets, not regular meat. I wonder if we have to make them. Is that one of something we have to make? Maybe that's what it is. I think it might be something we have to make. I'm trouble remembering now. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's strange that this section is protective of weapons, seeing that the dairy products don't cost much. Gotta go get, uh, go get some oxygen. I can't remember if this thing has a construction bench in it. So if it does, we can at least look to see what it is to take, make cost to make beef pellets. Beef pellet. Oh, it's synthetic manure time too. So it is manure I need. So I think I have one at home already. So that's three. That's so that's four. I need a bunch more of these. I think the best thing to do is to head back and see what we have are working with back home first. Actually, no, probably the best plan is to gather as much synthetic manure as we can get our hands on before we head back. Six, that's three more, that puts us at seven, so we only have one at home. more oxygen. I think I'm gonna bank on us having more back at the place. So I'm going to get oxygen here and then travel back to the main module. I'll check in when you get there. Something is stuck in the cooling gel or someone. In any case it's impossible to break it. Man. I uh, got distracted on the way. Hello. This is impossible to break him out. 
Is this oxygen in here? Touch it without having a degree in engineering. If I were you, I wouldn't touch anything, even myself. Start the engines. Um, I'm not sure I'm going to do that right now. All right. Well, that's interesting. We'll come back for that. I stay on task. I know it's weird, right? I do my best to stay on task. <laughs> yeah, I think we're too short. Oh no, we're good. Exactly enough, it looks like. Alright, let's be sure here. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Alright, we're good. Ten. Ten's the magic number. Let's go start some engines. All right, we're here. I'm gonna leave this a little ways back. I don't think it's actually in danger, but just to be sure. I also haven't really looked at this at all. Appears to be nothing. Okay. All right, you. Got it. All right. Next. Whoops. Well, that didn't work. I lowered the radiation, I though. I think you're almost there. You can probably ignore the cooling gel's slight course deviation and assume that the core's activity is partially reduced. Okay. Interesting. All right, let's go turn on the, the other uh, engines over here, and then we'll close with the episode for today. Whoops. I think it'll just melt this dude out. Wait, where'd it go? Miss. There it is. Turn around there for a second. the identification of the deceased slightly <laughs> toy from the grumpies collection they launched its production in honor of the anniversary of the synthetic cows invention and to be more exact memory of live cows after synthetic cows invention there was no sense in breeding and keeping the live ones so the this led to the almost complete extinction hey, there's a whole thing just to get that okay well is there oxygen in here? I forgot. No. No, there's not. Okay. I think I'm gonna have to use a candle. I'm not within uh, oxygen distance of anything. I thought there was oxygen in there. Alright, um... Whoops. That's bad. I dropped it. There we go. Alright, I'm going to stop here for today. See you guys next time.